what's going on guys i'm here with my buddy ken and um we're gonna go to the easternmost range of um of west texas try our luck at shining some cuts cruising some snakes see what we find um they got rain like three four days ago and um they got a lot of rain quite a bit of rain so um humidity is high um pressure is low um so yeah it's, it's a bit early for uh, for alterna but uh, we think that sh they should be moving you know at least males looking for females so maybe we'll get lucky maybe we'll get skunked but if you're watching this we did pretty good so anyway uh we'll catch up with you guys later see ya We found a board. Doesn't look that great, but eh, sucks. Delete that. <laughs> we saw another one. Where is it at? Oh, I see it. That one looks better. Oh, that's not good. Oh no, it's just sitting on top of the grass. All right, we're trying. If you guys are ever in Del Rio, Memos, awesome place. Yeah. And they have awesome food. Look at that. San Felipe Springs. San Felipe right Springs right there. Some people over there taking a, taking a little swim. We haven't even gotten our drinks or food yet. We just got here. But look at that. Good salsa and, uh, and chips. So let's see how the food looks. Yeah. All right. Don't grab the handle, please. We will. some more of that that be great. Let's eat, huh, Ken? I think it's time to eat. And then we have to walk it off. We'll walk we some cuts. Walk it off. We can do that. Yeah, we didn't like it at all, right? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Didn't like it at all. All right, guys. We just flipped a Brimini's blind snake. Don't let it go. It was under this rock, by the right spring. by our restaurant, by the springs. We're gonna take it home and breed it and start our own colony. <laughs> it's Very pretty cool. cool. First snake of the trip, blind snake. All right. Filling it up. Over here in Del Rio. Um, Ken's going, it's inside. He has a uh, mug he wants to fill up with coffee, so. Anyway, gonna fill her up and uh, hit the cuts. All right. Made it out to West Texas and Ken. we got coffee too. That's what's important. So you got the good stuff. And Look at uh, these century plants kicking up their reproductive stock. Look at that. Mexican free-tailed bats are going to be feeding off that. Don't they do that? Yeah. yeah sure. Anyway, let's see what we find, guys. A sleeping bird. A oh, sleeping bird. Yeah, you see it. You're right. Here, wait, wait, wait. Let me grab it. Let me Let grab me it. Touch it. No, 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 no. Don't touch him. Well, let me grab him. Look at that! What kind of bird is that? I don't know. But that's kind of cool. It's not really happy. Hey, can you. you can you video it? Let me let me grab it better. 
Hey, buddy, I'm sorry I woke you up. <laughs> I'll let you go. It's a pretty little bird. It is. Well, let me let him go. All right. Oh, you want to take a picture before I let no, him go? No, we already did. Okay. Be free. That was like hell for a bird. <laughs> it's okay. Hey, guys, found a Mediterranean gecko. Good sized female. Anyway, I'm going to let it go and keep herping. All right, guys. On top of a cut. Um, haven't seen any snakes on the cut. We've seen plenty of geckos. Mediterranean geckos. A lot of millipedes. Spiders. Tarantulas. But no snakes. But it's still early. 10 o'clock. So hopefully uh, stuff starts moving here shortly. But uh, anyway, Ken's down here shining, down there shining. If you guys can see him. Anyway. Yeah, it's really hard to focus. Catch up with you guys when we see something. Well, we haven't found any snakes, but we found a snake shed. And for sure an atrox. No doubt. No doubt. But uh, some button, maybe. What, two year old, you think? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. it's a small one. It was half in and half out of the crack. Wow, that's pretty cool. Anyway, we'll keep looking. Alright guys, we got a snake. And it is a rough green snake. Look at that, guys. What a cool... I'm going to grab it. Here we go. Wow. What is it, buddy? Rough green. Hold on, guys. There it is. How did you see that? It was just sticking out like a sore thumb on this dry brush. Oh, shit. That's cool. Here, grab it. I want to video it. It's kind of hard to video with one hand. Bright green, that thing. Very good looking little serpent. Alright, well we didn't get skunked, Ken. Well, you have found two snakes so far. Yep. This is the the best one. For sure. Way better than that Brimini's. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, I wanna see that face. Let me get a good look at it. There you go. Awesome. Got it? Let me see. What a beautiful little snake. No kidding. Look at that. The yellow, yellow and green face. Those beautiful eyes. Wow. All right, well, we're gonna take some pictures and uh, let it go. But uh, yeah, these little guys are uh, insect eaters they'll be eating grasshoppers crickets all kinds of bugs they're primarily insect eaters right ken yeah i'm sure they'll, they'll eat lizards but uh very cool i think it's a great find anytime you find a rough green snake in west texas uh-huh but look at that all right well, we're gonna take some shots and let it go all right guys so we're gonna Go ahead and release this beautiful animal we're going to help it out a little bit and put it on some greenery which was like two feet away <laughs> but anyway see you later there it goes and it just disappears cool let's keep her all right guys we found another well i found another <laughs> rough green snake a smaller one this one's a baby maybe a yearling but look at this little thing this one's got a little scar on the top of its head i don't know if you guys can 
see it. It is a small little thing, and you have eagle eyes. With all the movement of the wind, you see this. Well, it was just, it was sticking out. But it's a pretty little thing. Yeah, and it was, you guys see that? It was like right, right over there. Anyway, we're gonna take some pictures and then release this little guy. All right, Ken, you wanna do the honors and release it? Uh, you release the last one, it's my turn. All right, all right, here we go. Yeah, it was right on top of there. Look what I got here. A little bunny rabbit. Hey, buddy. Hey. What's going on? There he goes. See you later. All right, guys. Little update. It's 1248. Uh, we've only found those two snakes on the cut. The, uh, two rough earth snakes and uh, that's it pretty much it um, not a lot of stuff is moving haven't seen any DORs on the road no snakes crossing the road so that is it but still got a few cuts we're having fun and it's always nice to be out here instead of, instead of uh, sitting in your couch, finding nothing. So, anyway, gonna keep shining and see if we get lucky. Look at that guy. Painted one plane. Sorry, cut off the video, but look at that bird. That's the nicest bird in Texas. The most beautiful bird. Ken, yeah. come here right now. That? Painted buntling. Sure is. Good wow. He was down on this cut. I could have grabbed it, but I don't. I think it's illegal to touch him. I think it's the most beautiful bird in Texas, sung bird in Texas. It's not it looks like somebody spray painted it. I found this. <laughs> what? Let me see. This is a marine iguana. <laughs> it's, it's outside of its range. Very much so. Anyway, we'll uh, keep her. All right, guys. It is 114, 75 degrees. Still only two snakes on the cut. I don't like her odds, <laughs> but I've gotten quite a bit of footage. So I think it's, you know, it'll be a short video, but I think it's enough for a video, but hopefully I get lucky here. I really like this stone. I think, I think uh, lizards like it too. So where there's lizards, there's snakes. So, let's see what we find. I think I'm gonna not call it quits. I'm gonna go, uh, sorry, Ken was kicking some stuff. Um, I'm gonna go pretty late, I think. Even if Ken wants to call it quits. Uh, he can sleep in the car while I look. But anyway, let's see what we find. I like it. All right, guys. <laughs> we, uh, we're going to road cruise. It's 136. 
I'm gonna road cruise a little bit this off the path, uh, off the beaten path road. Um, we're gonna try and uh, find another road to cruise. Find um, road going south toward 90. Yeah. See what we find. But uh, it's 72 degrees right now. A little cool. A little cooler than I'd like to uh, for for road cruising, but you never know. Lamper Pelt is like it a little cooler, so we might see a milk steak or Splendida or uh, you never know, a Great Banded King Snake. But uh, anyway, um, if we don't find anything, we're going to go back to the hotel room and call it a night. So we'll see uh, either you see us tomorrow if we didn't find anything, or we'll see you in a little bit with a snake. Good morning guys, we are heading home, um, we only found those three snakes and uh, yeah we saw lots of wildlife, that pa painted bundling was really cool at the end. A ten skunks. And, oh yeah we saw a bunch of skunks right Ken? Yeah. But um, we had fun. Um, but yeah, I think it was just a little too dry still, even with the rain they got. They didn't get considerable considerable rain, I don't think. It was a little too windy. Yeah, it was it was a little too dry and it, it got close to it was what seventy one when we when we left when we, when we called it. Yeah, we called it. Yeah, but uh, we even saw like Ken is a is a big cactus guy and he we saw cactus like melting like just dry so that was kind of weird and a lot of a lot of dry foliage and a lot of dry trees and just not optimal conditions but anyway i want to thank you guys for watching and uh we'll see you in the next episode